Hello and welcome back. Thank you for joining me today. Uh, today I'm going to go ahead and finish the PS2 uh, that I started on the last video, the one with the bad power supply. So today I'm going to go ahead and put it all back together to see if we're all good or if I need to fix anything else on there. Uh, here is the box where everything is. Right here. As you can see, everything's all in pieces. So uh, today's goal is to put it all back together and hopefully um, get it running again. Let's start with the drive itself. Now on this drive I did notice when I was going through these parts that I do have a bad ribbon cable. Let me find it real quick. Um, or what I think might be bad because it was just kind of floating around. This one here. You can see the uh, you could see that it's kind of all chewed up a bit. So I went ahead and ordered another one and we'll go ahead and swap this uh, for a new one when that time comes. So just an FYI there. Okay, so for this one, we're gonna go ahead and remove the cover, clean and lube the, uh, the shaft here and clean the, uh, the actual uh, lens. So let's do that. Let's go ahead and take this apart. Okay, that is done. Let's see what is in store for us down here. Looks clean. A little bit dirty, but nothing out of the ordinary. So let's go ahead and clean this out. Let me uh, grab some swabs. I just went ahead and ordered some lint-free uh, cleaning swabs. I'm not a big fan of using these uh, Q-tips. So um, I ordered some lint-free ones to uh, make sure I don't leave any residue behind. So that's clean there. I'm looking for an eject, an eject button to pull the laser out, or I mean the drive out, but I'm not sure where that is. Usually they're like in here somewhere. Uh, I don't see it. And I don't want to damage it, so for now we'll just leave it as is. Okay. Let's add some lube. This is what I'm using. Very little, not too much. Oh man, that slides so much better.
All right, let's put it back together. Okay, so what this is, we'll set this aside for now. This one's clean. Now let's check out the main board itself. Everything seems to look clean and in order here. I don't see any water damage, anything visibly wrong with it. So I think this board is probably good. Going to swap that out. Before I do that, let's test the battery to see if it actually needed to be replaced or not. Let me grab my my uh, battery tester. Okay, so old battery. It was dead. New battery. Good. So we have a good battery now. Okay, there we go. Everything else looks good. All right, next. So let's start with the assembly then. Let's get the bottom uh, cover. This is what we're working with here. Overall, in pretty good condition. I don't see any, any breaks on the actual case. So that's a big plus, unlike the last one. Uh, this one, hmm, a little chewed up, huh? We'll see how that affects it, if it affects it at all. Yeah, looks good. I was going to go ahead and, and put the um, board in here, but I think I need to put that together first as one complete assembly. So let's do that first. So let me let me get that started instead. You like this? Okay, just as I was about to assemble this, I realized that it'd probably be easier for me to um, uh, install the disk drive with this off. Uh, let me see, do I need to, yeah, I need to take this off from this. In order to get to these connectors here, or else it's gonna be kind of hard to um, get in there without damaging something. So let me see if I can do that. And then I'll just put it back on here and try to screw it in yeah it might work 
let's find out. Let's give it a shot. The ribbon cable that goes in here. Let's put that one on. That one was the one that was damaged. I think I might have showed you earlier. Uh, this one here. So I bought a new one. Which is this one right here. So let's put this one on. Mm, this one's going to go onto here and then it connects onto the drive. So if I, yeah, yeah, this one goes here. Here. Like that. Let's go up here. Yeah. These connect here. So let's do this. Let's get the drive and connect this like this, like that. Like that, and like that. What's that one for? Uh, I wonder what that one's for. Uh, am I missing another connector down there? I don't think I am. I guess we'll find out. Okay, let's continue. Is it the power? It might be the power switch. It might be the power switch itself. And where is the cover? Yeah, it might be this one here. So we'll see. We'll get when we get there. We'll worry about it. For now, let's try to get this back together without disconnecting anything. Possible, maybe. We'll find out. Be a pain in the butt. No, there's no easy way of doing this, actually, man. I can't do it like this either. I need to do this. I need to do this. I need to go like this and get this one in here. You guys can see that. Sorry, folks. Sorry for not knowing what the fudge I'm doing. There we go. Let's do this again. Are we good there? I think we are. Let's do this again. I think the longer ones went in here.
So let's put this on. Just this should sit there. Right there, right there. Let's reconnect the controller board. All right, time for a test. Don't you agree? Let's see if um, let's see if this works. Let me um, let me get the setup ready here. Uh, before I go ahead, I need to actually connect this uh, to connect the power. And in order to do that, I need to take this all out and get in here. So, with that said, uh, let me take this apart. Take it out of the uh, bottom bottom uh, shell and connect it and then um, I'll either put it back in or uh, leave it out we'll see but to save you the pain of having me go through all this again I'll see you in a in a few minutes here oh, for me minutes for you probably milliseconds but I'll see you I'll be right back okay where are we all right well it's been a couple of days since I was last working on this unit i had to walk away for a while it was driving me crazy um the problem was that it um uh, it's just a pain in the butt trying to put all these um all these rubbing cables back in especially the ones for the drive there really isn't any room unless you take it all apart so uh, that's that just took forever but okay we're back to where i guess it's a good point where we could still take it apart if something's not working or whatever so Let's go ahead and plug it in and see if our repairs worked. Well, mainly the uh, power supply repair. So let's let's find out. So let me um, let me turn on the monitor. Grab my cables here. Uh, let's see. This one is ah, here. We go. I've got so many cables. I need to figure out what, what's what. So this one would be my audio video. And then my power somewhere back here okay here we go fingers crossed ah deep breath okay and i'm gonna go hot okay i know you can't see it but the red light is on here i'm trying to be i'm gonna try, I'm try to be very very careful here not to uh, but uh, the light is on there for power so let's go ahead and turn it on let me connect the well i don't need to so let me go ahead and connect the controller all right uh controller 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 here we go all right let's see what version this is three nine zero zero one cool well the controller works that's a good sign all right, let's put a game in there. Eject. Should we try Final Fantasy again? Yeah, why not? Let's look at the cinematics. Kind of give it a little stress test. All right, fingers crossed. Here we go. Did the drive work? We did lube the, uh, we cleaned the lens eye. We lubed the shaft, so. Should work. Wait, did I? There you go. Okay, it's spinning. That's a good sign. Now, what's reading disk? Okay. Looks promising. Reading disk. Reading disk. Okay. PlayStation 2 disk. Is that good or is that bad? I have no clue. What is it doing? It's still spinning. What do I do? What do I do? Do I hit X? Oh, 
Okay. Good. So far, so good. Hopefully the smaller camera is catching this. I hope it is. Is it recording? Yeah, it's recording. Forget how slow these are. Okay, so far so good. I'm not sure if that screen was normal. You know, the hit X and all that stuff to start. Uh, let me know. But so far, okay, we're good there. Final Fantasy Project. Final Fantasy X Project. Like I said in the last video, I've never played any of the... Actually, I've never played any of the Sony games. I've been an Xbox person my whole life, so sorry. Not that I don't like Sony, I just... It didn't make much sense for me to have two or three different systems at once. I mean, I did back in the day, but when I got older, no. Okay, it looks like everything is working so far. Cinematics look good. I don't know if it's going to look dark on your end. Um, but at least you can kind of see what's going on. So I think we are good. Let me go ahead and piece it back together. And um, can I skip all this? Yes, I can. Piece it back together and test it again. Uh, we are going to need a um, a cover for the uh, for the front. So that's the only thing I did notice that is missing the front cover for the drive. Okay, let me go ahead and turn this off. Power. And let's piece this back together. All right. Off. Hopefully we have all the screws for that. Take this off. Well, that makes me happy again that we were able to fix this PS2 without having to um, replace the drive. I'm sorry. Without having to replace the, um, the power supply. Fix it ourselves. That's very gratifying. And I'm going to assume that these two are smaller screws. You can kind of see the, uh, the metal there. So these are probably shorter screws. like we're missing some feet so we're missing two of the four three more of the rubber feet so that I'll just get from a donor and we're missing this cover here so one cover and three feet other than that I'm looking good
All right, there we go. I think it looks so much better now, doesn't it? So let's plug it in, make sure we didn't mess anything up while cleaning it, which happens. Off, power, audio, video. Like I said, I'm going to go ahead and get a front cover for this to uh, make it look better. And power. Oh, turn it on. That always scares me, man. Very low self-esteem here. Okay. Power. The green light. I mean, the red light is on, so we're good. And I think we are good now. Another successful repair. That's two for two, man. Jeez. It makes me makes me happy. Ah, uh, what should I work on next? Well, I've got a Nintendo, a Super Nintendo. Again, also in pieces. Looking at it right now. Got this. Um that is in pieces. I don't know what the problem is. We have that. I have a, I've got two Wii's, another PS2 Fat, and two Xbox 360's. So, not sure which one I'm gonna work on next, but I guess you'll have to find out in the next video. Uh, all right, folks, it looks like we're good now. So, another successful repair. Thank you for sticking through all the way to the end. I appreciate that. If you have any ideas, any suggestions, any any criticism, anything that you want to, um, you know, <clears throat> tell me about, please feel free to say so in the comments, and I'll try to get back to everybody as soon as I can. I do try to get back to every single comment. Sometimes I just get overwhelmed with work and I don't have time, but I'll try my best. Uh, other than that, thanks again for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Take care.